Hi guys, welcome to my channel. Today I will show you how to make a car race game on scratch. You need to control your car and don't touch obstacles. Try to hold out as long as possible and get the biggest score. Let's start to create this game. As usual, we create a new project and upload our own sprites. Let's add car, go to costumes, convert to vector, let's turn the car and make it smaller, change size. Now let's add background, I am upload grass, go to backdrops, convert to vector, change size and then we need to add road. I upload background, then select it, copy and paste here, put it in the center. Let's program our car. The car should move when we press arrows on our keyboard, go to right and go to left. As usual, let's do it when the green flag clicked, forever loop and condition if K right arrow press, we change our x coordinate by 10, duplicate and left arrow negative 10. Yes, it's moving. Let's add some turn. When the car go to right, it should slightly turn right and when the car go left, it slightly turn left. We need point in direction. Let's check it here first. When we press right arrow, we should go to right and turn it to right, like here, 105. When we press left, it should turn to left, it's like here, 75. 75. Let's check. Yes, it's turning, but if we don't press any key, just point in direction 90. Now let's add right sides that our car does not go beyond it. So we should paint new sprite and tiny left road side and then and duplicate it and it will be right road side. Let's rename it. And when the car touch road side, it should go to another side. So we create if if touch left road side, the car should go to the right. We should change x by 10. And when we touch on right side, we should change x by negative 10 going to left. Let's check it. Now let's add some obstacles. We can download them from library pedal and I want to change color. So the obstacles should appear in the three different positions here in the center, on the left side or on the right side and then go down. So the first position is center here is zero y coordinate is constant 170 it's the first position in the center the second one on the left side somewhere here minus 100 on the right side just 100 by x the obstacles should appear randomly. For doing this, we need a pick random. We have three different positions, so pick random from one to three. And if pick random one to three is first one, we should go to this. If pick random from one to three is two, we go there. In all in other cases, we go there. As you might have guessed, 
we should use condition if else. If pick random is equal one, we go there. Else another more condition. Pick random is two, go there. Else go in third position. Forever check it. Let's check. Yeah, it's <laughs> forever change position. After this, obstacle should go down. So we need to change y coordinate by negative 10 for going down and do it until we touch an H. So we need repeat until touching H. Let's check. Now let's add condition if the card touches the obstacle, the game stops. If touching obstacle, stop all. Yeah, it's working. So our game is almost ready. Let's add some speed and score to the game. Let's create variables. After obstacle touching age, it means that we didn't touch this. We should change score by one and with the click click course set score to zero let's try one two three great it's working now let's add speed the longer we play the fastest game will be we create a new variable called speed and we should change how fast our obstacles move so instead of change y by by minus 10 we should change y by speed but speed is a positive value that's why we need minus we just need multiply by minus one change speed all the way down just 0 0.1 and let's set speed to 7 when we start let's try yeah our speed is increases and the game became faster cool but i think we need more obstacle let's just duplicate this sprite but also we need change this condition touch an obstacle or touch an obstacle too so no operators we choose or touch an obstacle touch an obstacle too great you, as you can see our obstacles appear at the same time so let's change a little delay i want this will be wait for example one second and after this show first height after one second show it will be a little delay between our obstacles yeah now it's better just maybe change side of the car a little let's add speedometer picture to our game i upload this change size like this and I want speed will be here just for making our game more beautiful and let's point score here cool I think our game is ready but let's fix some one problem as you can see sometimes our obstacle appearing together because we need just it put it here not just in the loop yes i think it's better great our game is ready but let's add some more fun let's add dark mode to our game in the dark mode car will have lights and backdrop and road sides will be darker let's add lights we should paint them just click line we should paint something like here 
yes and then when selected copy past and then flip horizontal and put it near let's change size the center of the costume should be here our light when the green flag click should hide but when we get dark mode it should show first let's decide when we should turn on our dark mode i think we can check our score for example if score is already 20 then let's broadcast message new message dark mode forever when i receive dark mode the backdrop should change to the second one with the dark grass i go to my dark grass upload and upload raw dark and made dark one backdrop switch bedroom to grass dark and when the green flag click to the light one road side should also change color to the dark one so go to costume duplicate it click and make it darker and go to another one duplicate and change okay our speedometer should go to front let's click here cool road side when the green flag click switch costume to costume one when i receive dark mode switch costume to the second one in the same here i can just move it right here cool let's check it when we start it's okay but when i get 20 points it will should go to dark mode yes our dark mode is on but let's just show our lights lights should always go to car and a little turn like our car does when i receive dark mode should forever go to car and show and also it should turn like the car does forever it points in direction 90 but if we press right arrow or press left arrow it should turn remember if left arrow pressed we point in direction 75 right arrow 105 so let's do the same right arrow point in direction to right here in point in direction left a little let's check it cool our lights it's appearing but as you can see it is appearing on top of our car our car should go to front go to front yes it's cool just let's make light um, bigger just go to costumes like this all right i think our game is ready thank you so much for watching this video i hope you enjoyed it Please like and subscribe to my channel and don't forget to click on bell icon. See you next time. Bye.